You know, Sinai, to begin with, is already a very... It's not complicated, but it's a very pain-in-the-butt map. Because, especially at the higher BRs, there's just a lot of sniping. It's too small. At 6.3, it feels right. The problem is, and it's the same thing with battle maps. They're all the same problem. The cap point, or your cap point is so close to the spawn that for the enemy to take the cap they're spawn camping you so that they can take the cap and you have no chance or opportunity to get out of your spawn to defend your cap unless you have cas and that's why the battle mission just needs to go honestly just get rid of the cap points and just make this team deathmatch even though that's what it already is, it just needs to be set that way so that at least people aren't trying to go straight for the jugular and go for the spawn camp. Because after they're on the cap, unless you have people outflanking doing other stuff, it doesn't matter. Now on this one, from the looks at this point right here, team two is pushing to where the C point normally is and they're gonna do pretty well here, except they get caught up. Their heavy tank that's in the most Northern spot that's lit up right now, he is a tiger and he's not getting out of that spot and he doesn't know where to shoot the enemy tanks now there's a m24 no it's a i don't remember what it was it's a light tank german yeah i think it was a, a bulldog anyways it's not doing what it's supposed to be doing he's looking out to where the b point normally is he gets backdoored and killed and then team two just gets dismantled from there from that point you would think that they would spawn in and go okay the enemy is heavily on the C side or the right side of the map let's go the left side but no they don't they sit in their spawn and they just don't do anything and that's the problem with this map is there's no incentive for the team to leave their spawn because if the enemy is already coming for the cap well, you should just wait there and wait for the kill, right? But that's not what you should do. If the enemy is actively pushing you from that side, you need to get out, you need to move, and start outflanking them. Because you got to remember, when the enemy is pushing that hard towards you, it also means that they're not looking in the other direction. Now, Team 1 does have those players that are up by the B point. That's easily addressable for Team 2 if they would have gone to the left flank or to the left spawn, gone down that road, gone around them, and, in and attacked them, or even gone for the enemy cap because they didn't have anyone there. There's literally an SPAA. A light tank, a medium tank could have taken him out, no problem, and you could have decapped the point that would have caused Team 1 to probably redivert their direction and gone towards their cap to figure out one, maybe two guys would have left and team two could have addressed something but they stayed in their cap and they just sat there and sat there and that's the problem and the battle missions just need to go they're absolutely horrible they don't do anything to progress the quality of the game and it's just garbage if you think differently let me know in the comments if you know of a way to make battle missions better other than the obvious of moving the cap point moving the spawn points you know because you could do that but then you can't get there in time to defend it but it gives you the opportunity to get out of your spawn so it's the it's a double bladed sword you're damned if you do you're damned if you don't if the caps just go and you have a random spawn in that entire area like if the entire bottom section for team two and the northern section of team one was their spawn you didn't know where they were coming from it might make a difference but all in all just get rid of the battle mission because it sucks and from this point here team one is one all they're waiting for is the timer to count down because team two just all died and we have to wait 100 seconds now for them to be counted out of the game and by the time that they're counted out team one's already got their cap and actually bleed off their tickets with that, we'll catch you guys in the next video.